Hello boys and girls and other people and sentient creatures that will or have been watching YouTube. I will be hunting Jack the Ripper, the notorious um, serial killer from 1866. This is Jacob Fry. You've probably known him from his younger days. He's looking quite um, old now. Oh, here we go. Now what's going on? The spinning circle of spinning circles. Ooh. For 20 years, after the assassins defeated the Templars in London, the city enjoyed a certain peace until the autumn of terror. In 1888, London is plunged into shadow and fear by a series of gruesome and unsolvable murders. The brothels of Whitechapel... I think I got the time wrong, what, the date, history the thing I told you guys, where sorry. Where prostitutes are being mutilated and left on grotesque display for the world to ogle. Jacob Fry hunts the elusive killer to bring an end to the terror of Jack the Ripper. Get a move on, Mr. Finch. This is the story of a lifetime. Mr. Weaversbrook, I know you have more of the Ripper's letters. I told you to stay away from me. Stop publishing his letters. You've turned an unknown miscreant into a legend, and that's exactly what he wants. Jacob, thank God I found you. It's the Ripper. He's done it again. Rose. <laughs> Katie! Oh, he can't. No, he can't, Ev. And Lizzie. Not both. Not in one night. Nelly, remember what I said. Now go. How many more assassins must die before you see the truth? Only one more, Jack. You should have believed, Jacob. Now. I will hunt you down. Oh, hello then. I know you're there, Jack. The master of terror is afraid to show himself, is he? I am your shadow, Jacob. Yes, I'm following Jacob. That's it, dude. Stand up. Pay your respects to the greatest serial killer. Oh, crap. Come in. I oh, what, what happened next? <laughs> I tell I kind of moved, like, without moving, then. Let's bring some fear to these bitches. I got told off for killing randoms. The scent of a wounded Do some damage to these bitches.
How cool is this shit? <laughs> Stop! You want me, Jack? Come and kill me! It's like if Jason Voorhees was real in the Victorian era. This is not our way. This is my creed. No. You cannot escape me. your whole little mouse well that that was intense and by intense I don't mean I'm playing this in a tent <laughs> sorry bad joke I am a dad I'm allowed to make bad jokes going somewhere Jacob Jack you're sick Oh, it's better than the Master Chief end block fight in Halo 5, I'll give you that. Don't you see the irony, brother? Jack! Only you know who the Ripper is, but you can't tell a living soul because it would destroy you and the Assassins. <laughs> It's me! I am the solution. Whew. I don't remember much of the Jack the Ripper campaign. Whew. I nearly fudged a brownie on that bit. <laughs> From what I remember, that was very Nor-esque. Nor meaning like detective-y kind of stuff. Miss Fry? Inspector Aberline. Why exactly have you had me escorted here? My men and I have been hunting the rip around the clock for months now and we've nothing to show for it. At least nothing I can tell the public. What's the ripper to do with me? My brother has had me summoned here from India. Can't this wait? As far as I know, you may be the last assassin in London. What do you mean? Where's Jacob? I wish I knew. Your brother is nowhere to be found, even as an elusive shadow is committing the most hideous crimes this city has ever seen. And you believe this is no coincidence? The killer is selective and dispassionate and has left not a single trace of his passage. I have seen such a talent for assassination and avoiding detection only once before, when I worked with the two of you. And that is why your brother summoned you before he disappeared. You think Jacob is dead? I dare not believe it. But if he is, you may be the only person who can stop the Ripper now. Follow me. Let's do Ripper first. Let's all get the word air. And next day's headline. I mean, become Sarah's best country. So I'll track the Ripper. Face again today. I'll drop. Not fair. Gentlemen, like my lady drive. But the ride is tell me. Go see for yourself. This is where the it is first murder. Identified. Her husband hadn't seen her in eleven years. He barely glanced at the poor, mutilated woman before he had the gall to forgive.
forgive her for what she'd done. It's reported widely that Miss Nichols' finger bore the mark of a ring. It was forcibly removed, and the same is true for his other victim. The victim's body was found here, with her throat cut and multiple stab wounds to the abdomen. Old bloodstains persist. Mary Ann Nichols, time of death three months ago, multiple wounds. There's something around here. Oh no. Um, handprint. She placed a hand here, perhaps to rest. From her injuries, she may have tossed aside her ring at this moment. What did you discover? Right. So the hand was there, she fell, she obviously started like pretty much this. She threw it somewhere this way, more evidence. Blood splatter, strange place for a blood stain, something covered in blood struck the tree, her ring perhaps. She threw mark. that hit off there, must have bounced. It's a good job I like for Right. The blood stain. Ring would have went there. There we go. Ooh. Assassin's ring. A ring worn by assassins. I found Miss Nichols' ring. An assassin's ring. 